فَاسْأَلُوا أَهْلَ الذِّكْرِ إِن كُنتُمْ لَا تَعْلَمُونَ الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله وأشهد أن لا إله إلا الله وحده لا شريك له وأشهد أن محمدا عبده ورسوله. A follow up question regarding the fidya, the ransom, the terminally ill person, the breastfeeding and the pregnant. Uh, sisters uh, who cannot uh, fast uh, to uh, protect their children and the old men and women who are unable to fast uh, because of age uh, paired with uh, the uh, inability to fast being a disability or being unable to fast uh, sister Rahima uh, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala reward her. Uh, we addressed this in a previous video and uh, she had a follow-up question. What if the individual cannot pay the estimated amount of $10 per day, uh, which is a meal, a whole meal, uh, which is to be paid for uh, a poor and needy, miskin uh, person uh, in lieu of uh, uh, breaking the fast. Uh, basically, uh, for each day, she is supposed to uh, offer a meal uh, for one uh, uh, miskin. Uh, what if the person is unable to pay that? Dear sister, this becomes a debt between you and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. You should keep track of the number of days and at least the amount of money uh, which you owe uh, for each day you broke your fast and you were unable uh, to pay uh, until you become able. At any time during your life, if you become able to pay uh, that debt, you must do it right away and you should or you must write it in your will in case if you leave anything behind you any inheritance that this has to be paid before the distribution of your inheritance jazakallahu khaira assalamu alaykum wa rahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuh لا تعلمون